how to create a negative keyword list in Google Ads. I'm gonna walk you through step-by-step step how you can implement this in your own Google Ad account and you'll see just how easy it is. If you like this video, don't forget, hit that thumbs icon and subscribe. Let's go dive into my account. I'm gonna walk you through just how easy it is to do. Okay, here I am in my Google Ad account and I actually have a bunch of different campaigns. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go to the tools section and under exclusion lists, here is the home of all my negative, either negative keyword lists or placement exclusion lists. These are gonna prevent your ads from showing up um, for certain phrases for a search campaign and on certain websites if you're running a display campaign. So what we are going to do is we're going to click this plus button here and here we're gonna give our list a name. So I'm gonna call this, uh, let's just say generic negative uh, list. And here is where I'm going to add in my negative keywords. I'm gonna put each negative keyword like one per line. So I'm gonna to go to my trusty spreadsheet here and get a bunch of keywords that I wanna add as my negative keywords, control C. Go back to my Google Ad account and I can just paste it in this way. Okay, if you're wondering where did I come up with these negative keywords, I actually have a default list of keywords and placements and YouTube channels, etc. that we have in our agency that we apply pretty much to most of our, the campaigns that we run. If you want to get a free copy of that, you can just head on over to teachtraffic.com slash negative and I'll send you that for free. Be sure to check through the list though to make sure that all these negative keywords are ones that you do actually want to add as a negative, depending on what your kind of business that you have it might not be applicable. Uh, but these are the ones, the common ones that we kind of see come up a lot, you know, like hiring, employment, jobs, uh, free, all, all that kind of stuff. So then you click save. So then now we've saved our list, but we're not quite done yet because we haven't then applied this newly created list down here to any campaigns. So we can either click on this here and click apply to campaigns and then I can find uh, various campaigns I want to apply this list to. So that's one way of doing it. Or well, the alternative way to do it is I go into my campaigns Let's say I click on this campaign and then I can go into keywords, search keywords, negative search keywords, and I can then add my one of my lists, my generic negative keyword list that I've just created here. So let's just say here and then I can click save and then all those keywords that I created in my list have now been applied to this campaign. So if we go back to our tools, uh, and go to uh, my exclusion list. You'll see here that my newly created negative keyword, uh, generic negative keyword list has now been applied to one campaign. So these are the two ways that you can really add, um, apply that list rather to your various campaign or campaigns. The same principle applies for your placement exclusion list. So you simply just go here, click plus, create new list and then what we're going to do is we're going to let's pretend we want to add in um, you, a whole bunch of YouTube channels that we've got here so we've got you know, 1200 odd rows go back to Google Ads and I'm going to enter and I'm going to enter these URLs and add that 100 1200 or 31 uh, and so we can call it here our uh, baby kids you, YouTube channels uh, and then we can click save and once again, then we've got our channel here that we've created, hasn't been applied to any campaigns and we can do exactly the same process of either clicking here and go apply to campaigns or go into our campaign and apply it that way. All right, so that's how easy it is to create your negative keyword list or placement list and apply it to your campaigns. If you like this video, maybe check out my website, teachtraffic.com. Definitely check out uh, our free negative keyword list that I'm happy to provide for you. Uh, and don't forget, like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.